Nenny. What was I thinking? Hello everyone! Welcome back to the bottom of the well where we got a useless item! Sorry it's been an age and a half since I got my uh, two videos out. I got distracted with school and a play I'm in. But now I am here, at least for a little bit. Um, we're gonna try to get as much done in this game as we can. Um, so let's get started. I'm going to begin by attempting to get the first bottle. Never mind, we don't have any pellets. So, off we go to Death Mountain! And there's zero music. This isn't just me cutting. Oh, okay. It's because it was technically nighttime still. But it is now daytime, and we're going up the mountain. Alright, we're just gonna scooch on by this guy. Oh, shoot! Ah! Uh, forgot he turns there. Ah, uh, gosh dang it. Alright, round two, big boy. Come at me. Come at me. Nope. Jeez. Okay. No! Oh, that's right. We have to go get Saria's song. <laughs> Fortunately, there's a little shortcut that we can take here. You're standing on a soft carpet for guests. It feels so plush under your feet. And that's why we should play the song that proves we're the royal family. Because it's carpet. And only royal people have carpet. Especially the rock-colored kind. It's my favorite. <gasps> oh, that's right! These have... Daku sticks in them! I wish these here were here. On the second episode, where it took us an entire episode to find... Sticks. Funnily enough, in the forest. But, you know, we find them in the mountains. Just as easy. If not easier. That makes sense. Oh dear, I forgot that happens. I'm not sure if that's supposed to happen or if that's a glitch of him trying to actually look at it. Either way, it's pretty funny. Also, I accidentally burned my stick. There we go. Shop's now open. I have six rupees, so I'm not going in. I think I can take this out. Maybe, no. Let's not do that. Oh shoot, I was right. Alright, lamp! Lamp! Yes, this is what I was thinking of. Alright, to the forest! Put it away, put it away, put it away. Oh shoot! No! Oh, he tried to pick it up. Okay. Well, we made it at least. We might be internally bleeding, but hey, we uh... Oh gosh, this guy again. Honey, over here! Woohoo! Nanny! Gosh, I picked Nanny as a name. Good to see you again. Listen to this hoot hoot! After going through the Lost Woods, you will come upon the Sacred Forest Meadow. You can tell it's important because it's in green. That is a sacred place where few people have ever walked. Shh! What's that? I can hear. A mysterious tomb. You should listen for that tomb too, ho ho ho, or else you might not be able to make your way through the forest. When you hear what I said again, please know. If you are courageous, you will make it through the forest just fine. Just follow your ears and listen to the sounds coming from the forest. Fine. This is when surround sound is nice. Even though it doesn't matter too much, but... Hey, the N64 could pull it off, so I might as well. Ah, my ears say this way. Here's a fun fact. If you're, uh... If you're going through the Lost Woods, you can tell which one's a bad way. 
because if you're far away, there's a little light tunnel. That little light effect means it's not the right one. You know, with the exception of this, because it's a load zone. <laughs> that was kind of a bad example. Alright, forced fight. Gotta use one of these. Come on. Hit me, baby, one more time! Oh, shoot. Don't actually hit me. Oh, jeez. That usually takes a few hits, but hey, we got seeds. I needed that. Hello, friend. Got him. He's dead. Uh, they say, oh, shoot, I'm gonna die. Just gonna scare them away. I could legit just die. Oh, dear. <laughs> okay. Oh, come on. Oh, jeez. Alright, well, before we do anything... I'm just gonna... Gonna drop into the ground for a second. Pick one of these babies up. There's your hint for the day. There's a fairy fountain there. Wasn't really that much of a hint. Anyone who's played this game knows that. Alright. Oh dear. Alrighty. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't take damage from that first hit. Alright then. Uh, I'm not sure if this counts as a cutscene, so I'm not gonna get copyright striked again, so see you on the other side of this. We learned a song. Oh, that was a terrifying sound. I did not like that echo. Uh, you know, this is gonna be the same thing basically in reverse, so... I'll see you once we get back into the city. Again! I didn't take damage from either of those shots. What is the deal? While we're here, might as well get some sticks and stones, quite literally. Actually, I think they're seeds, but... Uh... Uh... I'm gonna get money. Hey! Look at what we got! Slowly but surely, of course. Cool! You're great! You scored per three perfect bullseyes. I have to give a neat present to such a wonderful person. Please take this. You heard it here. I'm a wonderful person. Please like, comment, and subscribe to this wonderful person. Because he got that Deku Seeds bullet bag. It holds up to 40 slingshot bullets. And I get it refilled. No way! Oh, that's so good, actually. That's gonna help us a lot. And there is, in fact, a, an extension of the Deku Sticks you can hold. And you know we're getting that as soon as we can. Which I think is now. It's part of the Happy Masks uh, side quest, kind of. But I'm going to get this while I'm here. We're going to play a little, a little song for Mr. Darunia here. After... After I get the sticks, of course. You know what? I'm just gonna play the song out here. I'm gonna practice. Has Darunia, the big boss of the Gorons, really lost so much status to be treated like this by his sworn brother, the king? Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know that. Now I'm really angry! Get out of my face now! Are you asking why I'm in a, such a bad mood right now? Some people got on my things, started blowing them up. It's not good. Alright, let me try the song again. Oh my gosh! Oh my goodness. 
just like that, my depression is all gone. Something just came over me. I suddenly wanted to dance like crazy. Alright, you heard it here, folks. If you're depressed, you just gotta play a little song and it's all gone. That's it. It's all it takes. Alright, basically it's just saying, you want the stone? Go to the cave and kill the guys. So that's what we're gonna do. But first, he's gonna give us some bracelets that for some reason let us pick up the bombs. Don't ask me, I didn't make the game. I have something for you. I'm not really giving this in return for anything, but take it anyway. If you wear this, even a little fellow like you can pick up a bomb flower using A. How about in return for curing your depression? I feel like that's that deserves some sort of reward. So I guess this is fine. All right, off we go. We're here now. We're gonna check a bomb off a cliff and it's gonna be good. There it goes. Kaboom! I'm gonna show you a little trick now on how to get that piece of heart way earlier than you should have. I'm gonna take this and chuck it. Line ourselves up, take a backflip. Boom. There it is. We're not gonna pick it up because we're doing the three heart challenge because why not? Um. So in we go to Dodongo's Cavern where we will complete this dungeon in the next episode. Thank you for watching and I'll see you then.